my outfit today. I've been waiting so long to wear this top. It's gorgeous. And I keep doing this all day. I'll stop now. Hello fashion sewers, I hope you are well. If you are new to my channel, I'm Colleen G. Lee. Hello. My channel's all about DIY fashion. On a Friday, I do my outfits of the week where I show you garments that I have refashioned, garments that I've also designed, kind of and sewn, including some high street pieces. So I mix them all together, style them, give advice. So if you're into that sort of thing, it definitely is worthwhile subscribing to my channel. Not only that, on a Wednesday, I actually show you how to refashion a garment. Put it out there, hoping to inspire and share the information so that you can go out and be motivated to do something similar. If you're interested in that sort of thing, it still is definitely worthwhile subscribing to my channel. Let's get on with the video. This is, let me just show you. Oh, this used to be a punk show and it wasn't doing anything for me. So what I decided to do was create this unusual kind of top. It is slightly restricting. When I say restricting is that I don't have that much movement in front of me, but I do. Um, but this is what happens. I'm gonna put my arms down. I'm gonna put my arms up. <laughs> and strangely enough, that's what I love about it. It's, but it's really stretchy, it's super stretchy. So if you are going to be inspired by this project, I do have a link to do to the, the, I do have a link in the description for the tutorial for this. Just remember that you do need some of that super stretchy because you will find it restricting. But then again, it may depend on the shape of the actual poncho that you do get. So this is kind of really rounded from the shoulders anyway. And if you find that you um, have a similar, a similar garment, which is more like 90 degree angles, there won't be that much pulling. Um, it's probably the best way to describe it. But no, it is super cute. I'm wearing it with my velvet pants that are three quarter length. Um, and it's got elasticated waist and yeah it's super comfortable it's got this little up on here and it's also one at the back as well here that's slightly hidden away but you know as i move my arms about it, it you do get flashes of it which is cute it's got this cape effect going on it really is cute and so yeah so this morning i've been on um, a webinar so um it's always that case isn't it <laughs> webinar dressing <laughs> online sort of thing um but yeah that's my outfit for today i'll see you tomorrow my outfit today i've been waiting so long to wear this top it's gorgeous and i keep doing this all day i'll stop now um it's a refashioned skirt onto an old top that i've had for a while um what else? The pants are my wide bell bottom blue pants, so I've been coming down shortly so you can have a look. And yes, I'm just really enjoying wearing this. I haven't been wearing it that long, about an hour, an hour and a half. But I, yeah, I'm a bit I'm a bit challenged at the moment because I keep doing this. Because because just because why not? Well yes. It's an idea that I know I'll develop again, so whenever I'm in the charity shop, I will be looking for feature skirts. Maybe, you know, do one with, with a cuff idea. Maybe change up the idea of the shoulders and stuff, but I'm loving this. It really is cute. So, like I said, um, I'm wearing some wide bell bottom pants. I've been the camera down now, so you can have a look. I've just got Silver earrings, down the earrings, this necklace. I like it this necklace sat like that. I think it would be much better. But this, yes, just like that. I think that would be a case of me tacking, <laughs> tacking it into place. Um, but I'm not going to get there. But yeah, I'm bring the camera down. I'm all about 
about inspiring, motivating and sharing ideas for upcycled fashion. If you're into that sort of thing, it definitely is worthwhile subscribing to my channel. Not only that, I'm on the Patreon platform where there are three different levels. Check the description and I hope to see you there. Let's get back to the video. It's very much a jewelry day today. It is a top that I've made and designed many years ago with the skirt, it's a straight velvet skirt with a fist at the back and just a simple straight top with the shoulder cutouts yeah, that I made years and years and designed years and years ago. Anyway, we're in fashion now so I thought I'd just pull it out. It's quite long so I've kind of brooched it around my middle like so and having it asymmetrical in the way by just slanting it to one side and yes I've got lots of jewellery on and it's partly because the sleeves are three quarter length and sometimes it can be distracting from the fact that you don't want to keep pulling down your sleeves if you've got jewellery on so that's a tip and um, it does work actually oh, it feels, um, well, at least for me anyway. So this is the top and the skirt. I'm just wearing it with a pair of simple court shoes um, that are also navy blue. The skirt's actually black and the top's navy blue. I have noticed all this week I have been wearing black and navy blue. Was it intentional? It was actually. And I'm just looking for items that I haven't worn for a while. It's like, yeah, need to show that off again. And yeah. So this is my outfit for today. I've managed to film this at the right time because today it's been really awful. One minute it's cut, one minute it's, it's dark and dreary and it's hailstone and as soon as I put my camera on it's like we will get as dark as possible even though it's early morning and well it's around about 11, 30, 12 o'clock so I usually do this a bit earlier. Anyway I'll shut up and I'll leave you to your day and I'll just um, say yeah this is my outfit for today. See you tomorrow. My outfit for today is navy blue from top to toe. I keep him with that theme of wearing navy blue with a hint of black. And as it's Friday today, I thought I'd just do the whole head to toe in blue. Oh, I don't know, because the earrings are black, aren't they? Oh well. <laughs> so um, I am not wearing anything that I have refashioned or anything from the CGL collection. Um, these are all ready to wear pieces. I love velvet. See, this is the reason why I love velvet. These tones, as you can see, it's a very dense navy midnight, midnight blue. And since you turn, so the light catches it. It's gorgeous. Anyway, so that's my um, top, tank top, and I'm wearing the ladies' blouse. And that's also got the velvet. It's, it's I forgot what you call this now. This fabric. Oh, anyway. Um, so yeah, so it's gorgeous. It's got the chevron pattern to it, and I have styled it with a pair of leather style jeans which you've seen before and I'm wearing some blue shoes. So that's my outfit for today. Bring it down so you can have a look. Just catch the light there. Got an asymmetrical thing going on to the front. Just a very casual look for today. But I will be teaming it with, I haven't finished yet, Accessories, and I did make these. <laughs> yes, it's not warm enough in England yet. Even though I admit the uh, the sun is out, but it's definitely, definitely cold. So yeah, I'll be wearing my scarf. Let's see, if, let's see how that goes. Oh, that's not bad actually. with my clutch. Ooh, 
Yes, I'm liking that. Yeah, navy blue all day today. And I'll see you next week. Well, I hope you enjoyed my outfits of the week. Um, if you do, please put them in the comments and if you want me to continue doing my outfits of the week, showing you how I style them, hopefully giving you um, some tips and advice and sharing information about how you can wear your refashion makes either with garments that you've either um, sewn yourself or you know, high street pieces, basic to wear pieces. Um, yeah, so if you are wanting to share that with me, then put that in the comments below. Please do give this video a thumbs up and below the like button which is a thumb is the subscribe button if you click that that will be amazing it will really help my channel to grow don't forget to save this and share it with your friends let's see if there's anything else no i don't think there is and i'll see you next time thank you for watching